Right, welcome to another screencast from DIYPCRepairs.net and in this screencast I want to have a look at how we boot or start windows from CD or DVD. Um, you'll see in a lot of things, um, installing windows, running memory diagnostic, um, repairing windows from the DVD, um, the install DVD. You need to be able to get your PC to start or boot from a DVD. Most computers are set to start from the hard drive first it's always the number one priority CD will be next DVD but what we want to do to be able to run things from a disc at startup we need to be able to switch that around so we're gonna have a look at that now so I'm gonna restart this computer we're gonna hit restart now at restart we're gonna tap F2 um, different computers different BIOSes have different buttons but you usually find that it's on F2 or the delete key so we we'll press F2 then okay so now we're in the BIOS You'll see across the top we've got main, advanced, security and boot. It's the boot that we're interested in. So we use the arrow keys to skip across the boot. And then we use a down arrow key to get into the settings. Now, you'll see here that we've got hard drive at the top, as I said. Um, and CD-ROM, stroke DVD drive underneath that. So what we want to do is we want to move down to CD. And then on your number pad, if you press the plus arrow, the plus key, sorry. That'll lift the DVD-ROM drive to the top and put the hard drive in the second. So once we've done that, if we press F10, that's going to ask us to save the configuration. We press yes and the system will reboot. Now you'll notice now on reboot we've got press any key to boot from DVD. Press the key. I've got the Windows disk in. That's going to start up the Windows files. And that's how we boot from a DVD. If you want to do the same and put the hard drive back to the, the main boot, just repeat that, go in move hard drive to the top and F10 7 out. So that's how we alter the boot priority on our computer. Thanks for watching.